Hello everyone, my name is Manisha and you are watching our YouTube channel Punishka Tutorials. Today let's learn about soil and its types. Before starting, let us see what you actually mean by weathering. Weathering is a process where rocks are worn away or broken down into smaller pieces by wind, water or plants. It happens very slowly over a long period of time. A large rock due to weathering may be broken into small chunks of rocks and then to many more smaller rocks till they finally become soil or dust. This process usually happens near the surface of the earth. The cool nights and the hot days cause the rocks to expand and contract. This in the outer layer of this earth on which the plant grows is called soil. Soil is very important for sustenance of life on the earth. Let us see how soil is formed. Soil is formed slowly as the parent material that is the rock erodes into tiny pieces near the earth's surface. Organic matter like plant and animal waste decay and mix with inorganic materials like rock, particles, minerals and water to form soil. The constant action of winds, rains, flowing water and heat of the sun leads to the weathering of rocks resulting in formation of soil. This process goes on for thousands of years. Now let us see what does soil contain. Soil contains tiny bits of rock particles. Soil particles are of different sizes. First, let's see the contents of the soil. First is gravel. Bigger particles of the soil which are of the size of rice grains are called gravel. Sand. Sand are smaller particles which are somewhat the size of sugar grains are called sand. Silt. The powdered like particles are called silt. Clay, the smallest sized particles of the soil that is sticky when wet is clay. Humus, the soil also contains dead remains of plants and animals which are called humus. Soil also contains air and water. Soil layers. Soil is made up of distinct horizontal layers. These range from the rich organic upper layers which is often known as humus and the topsoil to the underlying rocky layers also known as subsoil and bedrock. Humus. Humus are leaf litter and other decomposing organic materials such as dead animals and plant material. Topsoil, it is humus mixed with mineral particles. This is where the plant roots grow. Subsoil, the mostly sand or silt and clay near the bottom. And the bottommost layer of the soil that is bedrock, the parent material for soil once it reaches the surface. Let's see what are the benefits of soil. Soil helps in the growth of plants. It supports the organisms that live in it like earthworms. Soil also affects weather conditions as plants are important to bring about rain. It helps in mining. It supports agriculture and gardening. It helps in making of bricks and pottery. Thank you for watching the video. If you like my video, please hit on the like button, share my YouTube channel and don't forget to click on the subscribe button. Thank you.